cases of COVID-19 are still relatively low compared to this past winter, but they have seen a rise in cases here in Douglas County, and that's causing concern for one business owner. Hi, welcome. We were probably one of the most cautious businesses on Mass Street. At Wonder Fair along Mass Street, face masks are still required. Huge fan of the vaccine, love it. Co-owner Paul DeGeorge says vaccines yeah, save lives too trying to run a business as safely as possible, knowing cases of COVID and the Delta variant are on the rise. We have a kind of a small store as well, and it can get pretty crowded. So, um, and also knowing that children are still unvaccinated. The George heard the news Monday that 62% of new COVID cases in Douglas County are people eligible for a vaccine, but have yet to get one. That means a third of cases could be young children, people who've had just one shot or breakthrough infections where vaccinated people get the virus. But none of the cases of breakthrough infection have the serious complications associated with it. So they are considered to be um, the more mild cases. So they're not causing hospitalization. Workers with the health department are still trying to vaccinate as many as possible. What we are doing right now is a lot of community clinics. Encouraging everyone in the community to stay safe. Right now, we don't have to worry about like what the what our next move as a business is because we're still requiring it and that feels comfortable for us anyway. Public health workers here in Douglas County say cases are still manageable, but they would like to get that vaccination rate up, especially in rural parts of the county. In Lawrence Matchleaner, KMC 9.